when you hi when you reach a certain stage like this you're saying <coughs> <coughs> what you need to do is you have to minimize and one of the easiest ways to get the great swatch or you can use the alt key with your per selection and try to minimize as much as possible the difference in tones the more you minimize the more you'll see that makes your life much easier because the, the complication is that how much do you really show basically if you zoom out you can see that how much do you really see in this landscape so it's very vital that all the detailing that you're seeing should be minimized and get the general strokes and feel your work i think one of the most important thing is how, how do you feel your work how do you get to make your work successful as well as have that consistency in the flow certain areas you might want to look at as you build things up and as you minimize what is your focal area focal point how do you get there So here you can see that I'm trying to minimize as much as possible and get the broader aspect of where I started off. Look at the broader aspect of what you're trying to do and where do you want to make your eyes go. And the grayscale right over here is actually your ways to, because in any photograph or in reality when you're actually doing a realistic landscape on side there's too much detail and what you need to do is focus on how to minimize these details and come to certain shape and forms so when you're on uh, what you call a tablet, one of the advantages is that if it's sensitive, you can you don't have to touch. You can get the brush tools, size and all. And you just click outside, and you can actually work on it. You can also do the right click on some of the tablet on your pen. Change the size. And remember, Alt is always there for selection of the color or tones it's 
Squint your eyes sometimes. It's always good to squint your eyes and see where you want. So this is the way slowly you develop your space. Some of you have already done that. It's getting better the more you work on it. But there's a time and space where you need to stop and understand where to stop it. So you can see that I've minimized a lot of space and the more I work with it, the better it gets. Using both the regular brush and the mixer brush really helps. Hope that helps. Thank you.